punk music, the rebellion against authority, and the relentless energy of Gallows, it's all coming together in their self-titled album. Gallows, a band that embodies the spirit of punk, has been making waves in the music industry with their raw sound and unapologetic lyrics. Their music isn't just about creating loud, energetic tunes, it's a form of expression, a rebellion, a way to voice out against the norms. Gallows isn't just a band, they've become a symbol for those who dare to speak their truth and challenge the status quo. Their new self-titled album brings this all to the fore, showcasing their unique brand of punk music. It's an album that's as audacious and uncompromising as the band themselves. So, buckle up music enthusiasts, we're about to dive deep into the world of Gallows, their new album, and the punk music scene. Welcome, music enthusiasts, to Fame's exclusive interview with Gallows. Let's get started. First up, let's talk about their new album. Gallows' latest creation is a self-titled masterpiece that brings together the raw energy, defiant lyrics, and relentless punk spirit that this band is known for. It's a thrilling roller coaster ride of hard-hitting riffs, thunderous choruses, and explosive performances that are designed to shake the foundations of the music scene. Every track is a testament to Gallo's unique punk ethos, their refusal to conform, and their commitment to creating music that is raw, real, and undeniably powerful. The album showcases the band's evolution, their musical prowess, and their unwavering dedication to their craft. It's a wild ride from start to finish, filled with moments that will have you pumping your fist in the air and singing along at the top of your lungs. So, if you're into punk music that's unapologetically fierce and defiantly non-conformist, Gallo's self-titled album is an absolute must-listen. But here's the twist. It's released on their own label, Venn Records. Yes, you heard it right. Gallo's have taken the reins and set up their own record label. Why, you ask? Well, the answer is simple yet profound. It's about cutting through the red tape and making music on their own terms. Imagine a world where you need to send 50 emails just to make one decision about your own music. Sounds exhausting, right? Gallows thought so too. That's why they decided to take control and run their own show. Venn Records is their brainchild, their platform to share their music unfiltered and uncompromised. It's their way of ensuring that the spirit of punk, the spirit of rebellion, remains untamed and unadulterated. Now it doesn't get more straightforward than running their show. So what's the plan to promote this album? In true Gallows fashion, it's all about taking their music to the people. They're setting out on a worldwide tour, ready to rock stages across Europe, North America, and even venturing into Australia and Japan. The members of Gallows are no strangers to the road, but this tour is special. It's about more than just promoting an album, it's about sharing their evolution, their new lineup, and their undying passion for punk. Each concert is a chance to connect with fans, old and new, and to let their music do the talking. They're ready to bring the raw energy, the relentless riffs, the thunderous choruses that define gallows to every corner of the globe. Remember, this isn't just a tour. It's a voyage, a punk pilgrimage, a journey into the heart of gallows. They can't wait to share their new lineup with their dedicated fans. The album is self-titled. Was that a conscious decision, you might wonder? Indeed it was. In the world of music, a self-titled album carries a weight of significance. It's a bold declaration of identity, a way for a band to say, this is who we are. For Gallows, their self-titled album is not just a compilation of songs. It's a distillation of their ethos, their spirit, their raw energy. It's a culmination of their journey a testament to their evolution as a band. Every riff, every lyric, every beat is a piece of their story. But why self-titled? Because they believe it's their most authentic work yet. It's gallows distilled to their very essence. It's their way of saying, this is us, unfiltered, unadulterated. They believe these are their best songs yet, and they want the world to know it. Because for gallows, their self-titled album is more than music. It's a statement. What's a typical gallows gig like, you might ask? Well. Picture this, a sea of enthusiastic fans, a whirlwind of raw, punk energy, and a sound so powerful it shakes the very ground beneath your feet. That's a gallows gig. The band thrives on the electric connection they forge with their audience during these live performances. Every strum, every beat, every lyric is an interaction, a shared experience between gallows and their fans. For gallows, live gigs are an opportunity to share their passion for music with those who understand it best, their fans. The band's ability to captivate the crowd, 
to draw them into their world of rebellious punk music is nothing short of mesmerizing. A Gallows gig is more than just a concert. It's a communion of shared beliefs, a celebration of punk culture, and a testament to the power of music. So, what's a typical Gallows gig like? It's all about the raw energy, the connection with their audience, and the music that fuels it all. Are there any towns or venues that stand out as favorites? Well, this might come as a surprise, but Gallows have a special fondness for Norway. You see, every band has that one place that just clicks with their vibe, and for Gallows, it's the land of the midnight sun. The guys love the raw energy of the crowd, the enthusiasm of the fans, and the overall atmosphere of the music scene there. It's a place where their music and message resonate deeply, creating an electrifying connection that fuels their performances. Whether they're playing in a small, intimate venue or rocking out on a massive festival stage, the band feels an incredible synergy with the audience. It's a feeling that can't be replicated anywhere else. As for the shows themselves, well, they're out of this world. The shows in Norway are nothing short of spectacular. Speaking of fans, any interesting fan stories? Gallows has a cult-like following, and it's safe to say their fans are just as fiery and spirited as their music. There are tales of fans traveling across continents just to catch a glimpse of their favorite punk band in action. And then there are those who've tattooed the band's lyrics onto their skin. A permanent reminder of the rebellious spirit that Gallows embodies. There's even a story about a fan who, in the middle of a performance, climbed onto the stage and started belting out the lyrics right alongside the band. Talk about dedication. But it's not just about the grand gestures, it's also about the everyday interactions, the shared jokes, and the sense of community that Gallows has cultivated with their fans. They've had their share of interesting encounters with passionate fans who sometimes believe they know them a bit too well. Do Gallows embrace social media? You bet they do. In an era where the digital realm is as real as the physical, Gallows have taken to social media with gusto. They understand the power this platform holds in bridging the gap between them and their fans, and they wield it masterfully. Their social media presence is as raw and unfiltered as their music. No PR spin, no sugarcoating. Just Gallows being Gallows, engaging with their fans in the most authentic way possible. They're not just posting about their music either, they're sharing snippets of their lives, their thoughts, their inspirations. It's a fascinating peek into the world behind the music, and fans can't get enough of it. And the best part, it's all them. Every tweet, every post, every reply, they manage their own Twitter and Facebook accounts, connecting with their witty and humorous fans. It's a great way to stay in touch and share a laugh. Why do they think punk has endured while other genres have faded away? Well, Gallows believe that the endurance of punk music lies in its sheer authenticity and rawness. It's a genre that thrives on its unapologetic attitude, a rebellious spirit that resonates with people from all walks of life. It's not just about the music, it's about a culture, a mindset that challenges the status quo and pushes boundaries. The band members have often expressed their admiration for punk's ability to constantly evolve while staying true to its roots. It's a genre that's not afraid to experiment, to mix with other styles, to reinvent itself. Yet it never loses its core essence, its spirit of rebellion. In fact, they see their own journey as a testament to punk's enduring appeal. From their early days of playing in garages to headlining massive concerts, they've witnessed firsthand how punk music has the power to unite, inspire, and energize. But it's not just about the music for Gallows. They believe that punk's endurance also lies in its community. It's a genre that brings people together, that fosters a sense of belonging, a shared identity. And in a world where people often feel disconnected, punk offers a space where they can come together, express themselves, and be part of something bigger. The band members also believe that punk's enduring appeal is a reflection of its timeless message. Punk is about challenging norms, questioning authority, and standing up for what you believe in. It's about defiance, resilience, and the courage to be different. And that, they believe, is a message that will always resonate with people, regardless of the changing musical landscape. In their view, punk will continue to endure because it's more than just a genre. It's a movement, a philosophy, a way of life. And as long as there are people who are willing to question, challenge, and rebel, punk will always have a place in the world of music. Punk is all about resisting authority, and staying true to your beliefs. That's a message that never goes out of style.